Local artists are following in Michelangelo's footsteps by taking their art to new heights. As CBS 2's Christine Lazar shows us, their work is bringing joy and comfort to some very special kids. When you think of a hospital room, chances are you imagine something sterile and drab. But one year old Anna Hagobian's room here at Cedar Sinai Hospital is anything but. When the toddler looks up, she sees a whimsical design with elephants and a rainbow of colors. Have you ever seen anything like this? No, no, but it's, it's fun. It's, I like it. A nonprofit called RX Art is behind the ceiling decor. Local artists, many of them internationally recognized, have donated their time to transform nearly all of the rooms on the pediatric floor. And our goal is really to help the patients and their families take their minds off of their illness, even just for a moment, and um, jumpstart their imaginations, bring them out of their present situation. In this room, the artist used real leaves and foliage from back east to design a room that feels like a walk through Central Park. Something to kind of let your mind wander and think about the outdoors, especially in an urban hospital when you look out the window and you see more like streets and cars to really get away from it all. RX Art has completed projects in children's hospitals across the nation, but Cedars is the first hospital in the Southland to debut their therapeutic artwork. They focus on the ceilings rather than just the walls because the children spend so much time in their hospital beds. The nurses report the colors have also helped to camouflage medical equipment. They don't focus on the equipment, they don't focus on the IV pumps or things that they know are going to hurt them. By the end of January, they will have 16 rooms completed here on the pediatric floor. The nurses tell me at any one time they usually have about 15 kids, so that means that each one of them should be able to look up and smile. At Cedar Sinai, I'm Christine Lazar, CBS 2 News.